What's good, viewer? This is Spanky, and today we have the Pokemon Select Articulated Tyrannosaur by Jazzwares, and I have finally figured out how to say that. It's Jazzwares, and this is Series 5. I will have reviews of all of these, of course, and I love, 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 love. This is so anticipated for me. I can't, I can't wait to open this up. I love these Pokemon Select uh, figures. They're great for their value. They're only $20, and they've been nothing short of amazing. You can only find them at Target. I still don't know what Trainer Team Series means. I, I still have no idea. What I don't know. But see, oh, ooh, in French it's called Tyrannicif. Tyrannicif. Okay. <laughs> French are a little bit weird. Anyways, let's open this up. Tyranitar has been released from this plastic prison. Good old 360 turnaround showing here. And this is just another great Pokemon select figure. I love it. I didn't know that he didn't have no neck. He looks like such a little tubby right here. I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know Tyrant Tyre looks so fat. Anyways, uh, let's uh, we'll do this. We'll go to the stand later. I, I love the stands for these figures. This figure doesn't need a stand, but they uh, they always include it for twenty dollars. That is just so great. Uh, but for articulation, we'll start from the toes. We get the little little bit of a articulation here. You can't really do much with it, but it is there and it does show. Quite a, not quite a bit, but it does show a little bit, so there is something there. We get the swivel here. It doesn't look like it goes 360. I'm only getting a little bit of give. It's almost not articulation. See how it kind of bounces back? Hmm. Okay. So, but it does kind of move around a little bit there at the base. Not much, but do get a little bit there. And then his knee. We'll go this one. His knee. I guess you can call it his knee. He, like I said, he's a little chunky. He got cankles. He's got cankles. And then we get the swivel here. And they are pretty limited, so like it doesn't go all the way around. It will stop. And then you get a little bit of a give kind of right there. And then since we're starting from the head to toe, or toe to head, we'll just jump to the tail here. This is what you're going to get at the tail. It doesn't even swivel. No swivel there, no swivel there. So a little bit up and down. That's all you're going to get out of that. And then there is no... Ab. It does look like it might have an ab crunch. There's no swivel at the ab either. Then the arms you get a swivel here. Again, it doesn't go all the way around. It will just kind of stop. It does not go 360, but just almost. Uh, there, there. So I'll, I'll get into that my gripe there in a little bit. And then you get oh, it's still there is a, if you can kind of see it, a little hinge joint right there. But it doesn't do anything. It's just he's just too he's too chubby. Um, and this is I'm, I'll get to it right now. They should have added this joint right here so that you could have gotten more front and back motion. That would have been good. Uh, I, I don't know how much it would have helped with him being such a chunky dude. But you know it, it it's not bad. I'm not complaining. Uh, well, I am complaining, but I still love it. Either way, this is by um, this has been the least articulated. Pokemon select figure that they've come out with so far, but you do get a little bit of head here It does not go left or right really at all just up and down slightly Then you get a little gap there, but I don't care about that and then you get a little He's ready to eat some food because that's all Tyrant Dar does apparently So the articulation isn't amazing or anything But they, they were working with what they were given and overall I think it came out really really good and I'm not disappointed and I still love it as much as I love the others. Let's move to these bases that I love so very much. Yeah, just and listen, listen. Just, just awesome. These bases hold so well. I don't think this Tyranitar will really need one because he's just such a sturdy, thick figure. Plugs it there in the back. But it is nice security to have a base such as this. So. We know that 100% he is never going to fall while sitting on your shelf or in your detolf. I mean, I've tested these before. I mean, it's just not going anywhere. Great. I mean, even even this is holding. And that's just, that's why I love these. these I wish they would, like, sell just the stands and give you, like, a, like a clamp or something so I can use it in my other figures because these... Man, these stands are just amazing. So, I mean, it's I mean, you could probably buy these, and they'd probably charge you 20 bucks just for the stand alone. But you're getting it with an amazing figure as well. 
So one thing that I haven't gotten much into these reviews so far is scale and like size. So Tyrant Tar is going to be just above six inches there. So they're six inch scale. I don't know when I say scale, I'm saying it pretty lightly because I don't know if Jazzwares has an actual scale to their figures. Uh, I, I would have to assume that they're going off and based off something. And I've, I've held up other figures to them. They do seem to scale fairly well to other Jazzwares figures, but as far as I've seen, there's not an official like 1 6 scale, 1 12 scale, or like the Zucan or 1 in 40 and Pokemon scale was 1 in 20. So I'm not sure um, if there's official scale such as that, but compared to other Jazzwares figures, they do seem to scale fairly well. Um, if they were to do like a really big figure, I'm, I'm sure, I mean, once they get Charizard, I'm, I'm rambling a little bit, but let's just leave it at, instead of me rambling, I, there's not an official scale, but that is six, just over six inches tall, and it does look good next to the other Jazzware Pokemon figures. So this is another 100% must-buy for only $20 Pokemon figure that you can only find at Target. If you like Pokemon and you like to get the figures, these are the way to go. I highly recommend these over... Any other Pokemon figure that I found, like in stores here um, and here in the 50 states, that I can recommend um, that you can find really easily. Other Pokemon figures, they're not articulated. Like the Scale World, those aren't articulated. They're just scale and they look nice, but these look great and they're they're articulated. So I would definitely 100% recommend these. Please check out my other videos that I have done in the past. I'm getting better. I think these my reviews are getting better. Um, so. Just check them out. I got more Series 5. They got, uh, there's there's two other that I have not released yet, but I have another one that I'm going to release right after this review. You're going to want to see it. You're going to want to check it out because these figures are amazing. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.